got tripped a little bit in the bullpen. I was like, that's that that was pretty cool. I hadn't had that happen in a while. So that was cool. And then um you know, I, I thought I did a way better job today than the other day of executing pitches with two strikes. Um, and that was huge. Uh, and then I got behind a couple guys, but then I came back and made some good pitches. So that was also another plus that I was, I was proud of and gave us, a, gave us a chance as long as I was in there. So, What did you say happened in the bullpen, Kyle? I couldn't hear that. Oh, I was just getting heckled a little bit. That, it, was, okay. it, was all, it was all funny, though. <laughs> um, what about working a walk off DeGrom? It's been quite a while since he walked anybody. That. So um, a one-time deal. I don't, I don't want to act like that was all skill. There was definitely involved there. Um, but I figured the first pitch I got was going to be the best one, so I swung as hard as I could. Uh, after that, then I think another fastball, and then three sliders up. If he if he'd have thrown the the good one that he threw to every one of our hitters, um, it might have been a different story. But uh, yeah, no, I was I was I was I was pumped. So I, I was I couldn't hear you. Were you thinking there was maybe any chance to keep you in to hit there? Or did you know when it got two on and after you pitched four innings, you were coming out? Uh, I mean, they, they said that if Pablo or if my spot didn't get up, then I would go back out. But um, I mean, I would have I would have given the bat to him too. <laughs> How much did Kevin Smith help you? He's great. He's great. We talked before the game. Um, super cool guy. So, uh, you know, just that, that relationship's coming along really nice. And, um, you know, he's a, he's a big body back there and he's, you know, super supportive. So he helped me kind of rein it in if I got behind in counts and he was, he was there the whole time. It was really cool. How much have you hit since uh, high school? Just whenever we play a, uh, a national league team through like through double A and triple A. So, I mean, like, before I got, here we have like five series in a row that were all national league, so uh, a, a decent a decent amount. Like BP basically every day, or no, not every day. I mean, I would hit in the cage with our hitting coach and do some drills for that, and then BP like the day before or day after, but nothing nothing crazy. In high school, though, you set like a record at your school, right? Home runs and all that. So like... uh, I think so. I mean, I, I hit I hit pretty decent in high school, so but it, I mean. Facing Jacob Degrom is completely different than, <laughs> than some of the kids I faced in high school. You mentioned being heckled, and you know it's New York, and there's a little extra juice there when Degrom is going. Just what did you think of just the whole atmosphere and your first real, you know, road experience? I went out early um, to just kind of get a feel of the stadium. I went on the mound when the tarp was on and kind of just looked around, and so it wasn't foreign to me when I got out there. And then same in the bullpen. Um, and on the screen, it was like a picture of both of us and it's like me facing him. And then you got his numbers versus my one inning numbers. And I, I, I wanted to take a picture of it so bad, but I was like, no, don't do that. Like, just, you know, keep, keep, uh, acting like you've been here before, but no, I was, it, it was super cool to watch to him pitch and, and then obviously pitch against him. Do you have any people here? No, I didn't. I, they came in for, uh, my debut the other day, though. So, 